Good morning again. Good morning again. Someone said, oh, what beautiful, oh, what wonderful. than our soon senior superintendent of police, Sir Christopher Wright, Christopher Phillips, to do a presentation for me. You see? Yeah, come up. All right. The so, Sir Justice Big is going to give you in the book, you're going to read what is on it. Um, I do this, you know, as a bishop in the church, we always acknowledge persons who work hard. And you, it's not a, a, a thing where you have a committee to choose. It's that you have some people just work around you, and I like to appreciate them a lot. And I don't want to give them spread roses when they're gone. I want to make sure I do my part before they depart. Amen? Amen. And so there's a, a just a piece that, uh, let me tell you something. If they can get me, then get she. She just bust right down the road. And she to remind me of our just a piece, Maxwell, who have been the station police over the years. And I remember last year we have acknowledged him at long service also. And so I am from my decks, and I'm saying to the just a piece, from my decks, from my decks, I want to show this justice how much I appreciate her and how much the police who she works with at the station appreciate her because she does dedicate them drive go out all type of night. And I was saying to an officer the other night, I'm sorry, you know my address. Them say, Bishop, me know you live, know you live so near, but yet so far, but I not tell you where I live. We just live right next to the station, but she live nearer. And so I want to um, call no other than Justice Joan Longmore Blake, just to acknowledge and appreciate her. And I said, from my decks, from my decks as a zone rep, I want to appreciate her because I know if them can't find me, them find her. Come on, Justice, get a, give her a round of applause. Come on, come on, come on. She didn't know that, you know. Come on, somebody let's clap her, man. The CBI call her, the CSS call her, the, she's just there signing, doing caution statement, everything she's in. Go ahead, sir. <laughs> Congratulations, um, Justice. Joan Blake, and it is in recognition of your hard work, commitment, and dedication for your service to the Portmore Police Station, South Zone, St. Catherine. Congratulations. I feel good, good, good. I feel, I feel good, good, wonderful, good. Every time I talk about Jesus, I feel good, good, good. I feel good, good, good. Yes, I feel good, wonderful, good. Every time I talk about Jesus, I feel good, good, good. I feel good, good, good. I feel good, wonderful, good. Every time I talk 
Bishop is going to come back to us and she has a very special presentation that she's going to be making herself. Apostle Bishop. Before the Bishop comes, I don't want to forget. But Mr. Matthews, just wave to us. Yes, could we put our hands together for Mr. Matthews? In the back, he's been recovering. Please remember him in your prayers. Thank you. Sir, come back now, man. Come back. <laughs> Sir, and the behalf of... The cameraman, them, they... Saint, where the, the pops are up to them? Where the cameraman, them, they come take picture of them? <laughs> <laughs> All right. And so, Reverend Ewart McDonald, JP, when I call on you to... Oh, this service for us, you never hesitate at all. And so as usual, this is our third year um, service, an annual service by the South St. Catherine Zone. And we want to give you this block of appreciation award to you, sir, to open your home to us in warmness and you have leave us a solid message. From the Justice of the Peace of South St. Catherine, we present this to you, sir. Woo! I love you, Lord, and I lift my voice to This time I'm going to invite all the justices of the peace. Could you just come and stand at the front? And we're going to invite our deacon, Adrian Levy. He's going to pray a special prayer. All the other national leaders, all those who are part of the JCF, they're part of our congregation. time in the house of the Lord let us stand each and every one mighty God let us stand and show our support hallelujah prayer time prayer time hallelujah 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 great God of heaven father of light almighty God father of life and eternal salvation we come before you this morning on behalf of here gathered before us every jp almighty oh god every member of parliament mighty god every member of the jcf mighty god who come into your house to honor you 
almighty God and to show their respect unto you this morning almighty God we present their almighty God their humility as they come before you we ask almighty God your blessing oh God over the responsibility that you have given unto them that they may execute their task to the best of their ability without fear or favor knowing almighty God that that which almighty God they are being appointed to do oh God was ordained almighty God even from the time of Moses almighty God when father they came before you Lord God when Moses was advised by his father-in-law to appoint such almighty God to help almighty God with the leadership straight down to the community level father I pray this morning that they will not take almighty God this task lightly but that they may understand their responsibility in upholding law and order father God we dedicate them each and every one that the hand of the enemy shall not prevail almighty God over them that mighty God evil shall not almighty God overtake them but that your people they will be as your people walking in obedience for this, oh God, their responsibility, Lord God, is part of that which you have ordained for them to do. Every fiery dart that the enemy may throw at them, let them be broken in Jesus' name. Provide for them financially. Almighty oh, God, that no bribe, Almighty oh, God, or any such that may seek, Almighty oh, God, to put theirs under the table, let it not be so that your people can be blameless before you. Mighty God, even now as they come before you, Lord, let their humility be honored each and every one here represented and that Lord God Almighty when they leave this place they can remember always and say it was good for us to be here Father God we thank you we thank you that this service was so well ordered and so well executed and that mighty God it will live almighty God throughout the tenure of their service the memory of this morning father bless father honor almighty god and take them through almighty god the rest of their tour of duty lord we thank you we bless you and praise your name for this morning and we ask it all in jesus name amen and amen and the church of god say amen hallelujah hallelujah Praise God. You may be seated just for a minute. We're a few minutes away from closing. A few minutes away from closing. And we're going to have the saxophonist. We're going to stand and he's going to do the anthem in a minute or two. Then we will have our pastor doing the benediction. And we invite you for refreshment. Our special guest will be served first. And refreshment is at the front there, but we have refreshment for everyone in the congregation, but we ask that you allow our special guest. Before the saxophonist come, I want to have the Greater Baltimore Open Bible Church say thank you to Apostle Bishop Dr. Karen Reed Hyman. Could you put your hands together for her? A fiery Bob lady that we hear that keeps going and going and we can see why Bishop Hyman really was a pleasure to have you and all the other JPs and all the members of the JCF gracing us with your presence we also want to say thank you to his worship the mayor Leon Thomas who would have graced us with his presence and also MP Honorable Fitz Jackson. 
all the persons who would have come in for the first time, thank you for being here. We hope that you were really blessed by the ministry in song and the ministry in the word. And I do hope for you and pray for you a safe and a great and blessed week. Could you please stand as we have the saxophonist, he will play the national anthem. Praise God. Let us bow our heads in our hearts as we close. Our Father and our God, we thank you that indeed you are the God of wisdom and love and mercy. Lord God, you've given us an opportunity today to reflect. And Lord, today we can leave here reassured of your love for all of us. And Lord God, that which we have lost in any way, God, you promised to, re to restore to us, O oh God. I pronounce a blessing over every family represented here. I pray for good health, wealth, and Lord, I pray that the favor, your favor, will pursue and overtake us. Continue to keep us, we pray thee, and we commit and we commend ourselves to you for every blessing. In Jesus' name we pray, and we say amen and amen. Raise your right hand for the blessing. May the grace of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the love of God the Father, the full fellowship and communion of the Holy Spirit, rest, remain, and abide with us all, both now and forever. Amen and amen. God bless you, my friends. Do remember that you are important and God loves you. If you came late and you want to know what time we start service, you're searching for a church, well, you're at the right place. Every Sunday morning, 7.30 a.m., we're right here. God bless you, my friends.